Hi guys and welcome to my new let's play of Hellblade Senua's Sacrifice. This is a game by a developer called Ninja Theory. It's a few years old now but it's been on the list for a while and it's actually gotten some mad love in the uh, reviews department. Um, in fact I even think it won a BAFTA for the audio, best audio. So very loosely uh, we're playing as this young girl, this young woman called Senua who's going into Viking Hell to fight for the soul of her dead lover. Now the game was made in collaboration with actual neuroscientists because it's basically an excursion into a state of mental illness, uh, which um, yeah, we're about to see very, very shortly. Um, so this is a totally blind playthrough for me. I haven't actually played it uh, before, and I'm, I'm really just looking to, to get into the story and, and see what this thing is about. So please don't scream at me too much if I, uh, if I miss some important things. Um, as always, if you're new to this content and uh, if you if you like what I do here, then please consider um, hitting the like button so that this video gets pushed up in the charts. Um, and if you if you like the kind of content that I'm producing, then please consider subscribing, as I am trying to get the older subscriber numbers up. Now, with that out of the way, sit back, grab your beverage of choice, and let's get into Hellblade: Senua's Sacrifice. Hello. Who are you? Doesn't matter. Welcome. You're safe with me. I'll be right here. Nice and close so I can speak without alerting the others. Let me tell you about Senua. Her story has already come to an end, but now it begins anew. What's happening? It's breathing from the dead. It's breathing. It's breathing. He knows she's getting closer. He can feel her coming closer. She's getting closer. This is a journey deep into darkness. There'll be no more stories after this one. Jeez. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? They're watching. Why isn't she doing coming? Back? She's doing this for him. She wants to rescue him. He's already dead. I can feel you coming. Shh. Coming. Quiet. My word. Oh, how rude of me. I never told you of the others. You hear them too, right? They've been around ever since the tragedy. Well, that's not quite true. Some are old, some are new, but they've changed. I think the darkness changed them just like it changed her. Can you see them? I can certainly hear them. Why isn't she looking? <laughs> Why aren't you looking? Look, up ahead. You see it too. You promised you could. Yes. It is real after all. She's finally arrived in the land of mist and fog. The place the Northmen call hell. Jeez, guys, this. It's like they're in your head as well. They're here. My god. Wow. Just... Look around and you'll see them. The drowned. The sick. The Look at them. Here they lie. Rotting in the fields and rivers of hell. But the dead don't always lie still here. This is not a place of rest. Can't do this. Go back, go back. 
they're going to do that to you. Can you see them? Can you see them? They're going to do that to you. Jeez. interesting it's like Can you feel it? we're a voice in her head as well rather than being her what is she thinking I can tell you she's afraid wouldn't you be you'd think she would get used to it by now after so many years Builds onto itself, growing stronger, towering over her. You might try and ignore it, turn away. But it's always there, just out of sight, where you're most vulnerable. It's like it knows that just enough light is all you need to see its suffocating power. She's brave to go on this journey on her own. But it isn't bravery that drives her. Bravery only means something to those afraid of death. Said it was fear. Runs far. Far deeper. So that, I think, must be the head of our... of our late lover. So this is it. What is she looking at? What is she leaving behind? I know what she's thinking. Jeez. Her thoughts. It's not too late to get into the boat and go back. No one will judge her. No one will ever know. Oh, she oh my us. god. She can see us? There's no going back. You can't do it. If anyone pushes away a world that conspired to cause so much suffering, there's nothing to go back to and worse to look forward to. Why don't you join us? Maybe you too have a part to play in this story. Uh, okay. Well, why not? Oh my word. It's to move. Well, it's to focus. Hang on, I don't like these controls. Let me just... Um... There we go. My god. Jeez, look at us. What do you suppose we've been through? You have to take a closer look to see. Why isn't she focusing? She needs to focus now. Do not she forget to my story, Senua. Because your darkness comes from hell. And your fate lies there. They say the burning of a corpse will take you straight to Hela's gate. But gods and the living will follow this path. You must leave the Isles of Orkney across the Eastern Sea and find a road that leads north and down through deep, dark valleys. After nine nights of riding, 
You will follow a great river and will find a bridge covered in gold. The path to Helheim goes from there, across the river of knives that flows from the dark world of Niflheim. Okay. That was, uh, fairly straightforward. I see it. The land of mist and fog. He's in there. The old fool was right. What was it he said? The river of knives across which lies the halls of hell. The place they call Helheim. He's lost. in Helheim. And the goddess Hela holds his soul there. Her dear beloved. Dillian. Dillian. So Dillian was uh, was her lover. What is she doing? Why is she doing this? Why doesn't she turn back? He's already dead. So is this not where like warrior souls go? His soul still lives. She wants her soul to be at the bridge to Helheim. I forget its name. She forgets too. But she does remember that only the dead may cross it. Yeah, those are, those are typical underworld Beautiful rules, generally. Only the dead may go. Let's see, shall we? Okay, I think up those stairs to the left. Can we interact with that thing? Let's see. Looks like it. The Northmen speak of nine worlds. The world of men they call Midgard. Sky gods dwell in Asgard. The gods of earth, harvest, wind, and sea dwell in Vanaheim. The good elves dwell in Alfheim. The evil ones dwell in Svartalfheim. The mountain giants dwell in Jotunheim. The fire giants dwell in Muspelsheim. Niflheim is the world of ice and darkness. Only the dead dwell in Helheim. And that is where you must travel. Okay. Thank you very much, Waymarker. Waystone. Jeez, like, could you just imagine having these voices in your head 
all the time. You're in danger. This isn't right. I mean, this oh, must be some level of disturbing. Do you know where you are? Where are we? Why did she do that? She shouldn't have done it. She can't go back now. <laughs> no, this is it. The hidden path. What is that? Big M? Sounds like he's really calling from behind you. I was just hiding. I find I live longer that way. Don't listen. Never let the bastards catch me again. Never! Wait. Jeez, there he is. Who are you? It's just a memory. Drew? Is that you? around you now? For my tales of the Northmen, pick on me. Truth. A liar. He's lost. An old fool. <laughs> truth is my truth. Hmm? It's good to see you again. You kept your vow. To guide you in this life and the next. I will tell you my stories of hell if I may walk with you. Tell me your stories again, old friend. I'm listening. The runes seal the gates to hell. Focus your inner eye. And you too will see what's hidden in plain sight. Okay, so we have to focus. Use your eyes. I can see one. So we have to... Look it in your mind's eye. Find one like it to open the gate. So find one like that to open the gate, okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, where would that... Where would that be? Red M's. Oh, wait. Is that... Here it is. Look towards the gate. And the gate won't open. It's the, it's the shadow. So I'd look towards this gate now? Okay, yeah, it's opened. Or no, it hasn't, it's just gone blue. That's fine. The gate is open. Go through the gate. Go through it. It's dangerous. Follow it. What's behind the gate? Where would it take you? It's not safe. Okay. I spent six years enslaved in hell, but I watched the Northmen, learned their ways. I know you did. You listen when everyone else laughed. My people pay the heavy price. Carry my stories with you, and together we will make the Northmen feel our fury. Oh, careful. Another voice joins us. She was trying to make them go away. Pretend they weren't real. But what good is that? When we are always here. My god, guys, my god, this... Like having these voices in your head all the time. I guess it's the same with heights. You can stand on the edge. And it's going to be okay. But you know that death is near, waiting for you to make that last slip. What the? Uh, okay. 
so you can fall off high places. All right, that's uh, that's good to know. We can do this. We can do this. You can't fall. If you fall, you will die. Yeah, obviously. Yikes. Okay. Good to know. So, yeah, we can fall off places and we can die. dead is ruled by the giantess, Hela, daughter of Loki. The gods feared her bloodline, bad on her mother's side and yet much worse on her father's. So as a child, the Allfather cast her down into Helheim and gave her power over those who die of sickness, age, hardship and self-slaughter. In all of the nine worlds, only Hela can resurrect the dead. To Hela, your Dillion was sacrificed, and with her you must bargain. Okay, so we gotta go parlay with uh, Hela. Alright, uh, so do we go down there, or... Is there anywhere to go here? That could be a way, but no, let's uh, let's stick with what we got for the moment. What is up ahead? Stay back. Look at it. You have to open it. The gate to Helheim divides the living from the dead. Is that the face of Hela herself? The half rotten goddess that rules over Helheim. Whatever horrors lie behind that door, she must find him. Shh. Someone's here. You mean someone besides us? We have another voyeur. What the hell? Uh. 
Alright, that, that felt good. Okay, come on. Bring it on. Oh, okay, that didn't feel good. That's what you get, son. That's what you get. Shadows, seriously. Come on, what the hell? Yeah, like I'm trying voices, but what the hell? Come on, Senua, get up. Get up. Jeez. So this is what happens if the rot gets us, is it? Oh no, this is just what... A vision. She has visions as well. Of what's to come. Poor Senua. The darkness does not bargain. It does not reason. It is rot. And now it has taken hold. It will spread towards her head. The seed of the soul. Until there is nothing left of her. <laughs> <laughs> All of her suffering will have been for nothing. It's just a matter of time. The dark rot will grow each time you fail. If the rot reaches Senua's head, her quest is over. Oh wow, so this is like... And all progress will be lost. Jeez, so there's even a permadeath feature to this here. Which is great. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. That is what Dillian taught her. With every defeat, the dark rot will grow and soon it will take her soul. For now, at least, she still has control of her mind. And she will fulfill her vow. Whatever the cost. So we've got our resolve now. Listen to me, Senua. The goddess Hela lies behind the gate to Helheim. To open the gate, you must first face the gods that guard it. The god of fire, Surt, and the god of illusion, Valraven. Spill their blood to open the gate to Helheim and enter the land of the dead. Okay, so yeah, we're just gonna go fight some gods. It won't open. Valraven, ancestor of the seers and master of ravens. He hunts his prey with his powers of illusion and feasts on their remains. Follow the path to 
Valraven and defeat him in battle to earn his mark. The gate to Helheim cannot be opened without it. Okay. Okay. So let me just see. So no, no mini map or anything like that. God, I would have loved a mini map. I do love a good mini map. Um. Right. Right, guys. We're going to take a quick break here. When we come back, we're going to be carrying on with the, uh, yeah, this fight against Valrhine, the uh, the god of illusions, and uh, hopefully we're going to be one step closer to opening the door to Helheim to get Dillion back, to get uh, the soul of Dillion back. Uh, that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.